Howdy Simmers, I'm the Simming Koala and welcome to my channel. I hope everyone is having a good day. We are back with Miss Harmony Cardigan, continuing on my Cardigan Legacy series. And I know what y'all are thinking. She looks a little different. Well, let me explain. So I go through phases with custom content where specifically with hair, sometimes I like to have just full on alpha hair. Sometimes I like full on Max's match hair, and sometimes I like both, a little bit of a mix. Right now I am in my entirely Max's match phase. It's something I go back and forth with a lot. Sometimes I just get really sick of styles and so I go to the other kind and it's a whole thing. And so I've gotten rid of all of my alpha hairs and everything is Max's match. The only alpha custom content I still have in my game right now is makeup because I cannot live without alpha makeup. It's just so much better. I gave her a bit of a Maxis makeover, but she looks basically the same. So with that out of the way, ooh, let me actually put these walls down. Uh, <laughs> we're basically picking up right where we left off. Not much has happened in between uh, last episode and this episode, but if you remember last episode, we made a few friends. We did a little room renovation for the Akiyama family and we actually need to get another gig going for her uh and once again we only have a room renovation so we'll just go with that it's for the elderberry residents and we do actually have some money on us now so we can add some art around the apartment and make it not look so like bland <laughs> and boring but i looked at the calendar and Love Day is coming up this week, and so I think we should make it a goal to try to get her with someone. After all, this is a legacy series, so she is going to have kids at some point. Uh, but in order for her to have kids, she does kind of have to be with someone. Although I have the foster care mod in my game. I think it's... where is it? It's this. I have a foster family mod that I've never actually used before. But we could make her a foster mom, maybe. Although I think we'd probably need a bigger place for her to live if she was to be a foster mom. Because right now this is a one-bedroom apartment. And it doesn't cater very well to kids. So, uh, but looks like our friend Penny is out here. So why don't we chat with her a little bit? It is a Monday night, so we probably can't stay up too late because she does have to work in the morning but we can do a bit of chatting so we can ask about her day uh we can do an impression add some humor into the mix we can have a deep conversation with her and because i just saw the tampon and pad thing i should remember to actually like buy these for her because harmony is actually on her period thanks to a mod that i have uh so She's not doing too well, so we should probably get this for her, and they'll hopefully arrive soon-ish. And she's doing okay with needs for now, so I'm not too worried. Um, I'll send her to bed when she actually, like, gets tired. Yeah, we'll just try to become best friends with Penny Pizzazz, basically. Oh. All right, and I don't think we have anything going on down here. We have that human statue still down there. Or, I guess, living statue. I'm going to call it human statue forever, I swear. Uh, But not much is happening right now. There's some people walking around, but other than that, it's pretty dead, which I'm not surprised by given it is a Monday night. All right, looks like she is browsing books again, and Penny has come to wash her hands in our sink. Okay, then. What is she reading right now? Reel her in. Uh, this multifaceted book gives the ultimate advice for chauvinist fishermen looking to reel in women and fish. Both just require the right bait, and they fall at your feet. Amazing. Amazing indeed. That's not how it actually works, but you do you. All right. What are we chatting about? Listening to Dramatic Story. Is your life pretty dramatic, Penny? You got a lot going on. The life of an influencer. 
We need to give Penny a makeover at some point because that outfit is not it. We have the nice scenery of cars in the background that don't actually exist. What is actually the view like here? Like, what does it look like out these windows? Wow. We actually really don't have a bad view at all. Like, this is really nice. Also, there's a billboard of Penny over there. I love San Maishino. City Living is one of my favorite expansions in this entire game, honestly. Oh, and she's headed to bed. But I, I love City Living so much. I remember how excited I was when I first got it because it introduced the singing career, which I am a big music person and I really enjoy singing. So getting to have that skill in my game just made it so much better. Alrighty, it is time to wake up. Real quick, what I want to do is I want to add some art to the walls, particularly in this bedroom, because it probably needs the most help, if I'm being honest. It's just so plain. So I want to just add some stuff into here to make it look nice. Alrighty, so this is what we've got now. We have just a little bit of art on this and a little tapestry thing, and then we have these and the mirror. And I think it definitely works with the space. It makes it not so plain, especially since we're only using like one wallpaper all around the apartment. <laughs> but she is getting hungry, so... Let's have some breakfast. We'll do eggs and toast. Why not? She has about an hour and 20 minutes before her next gig. So we can hopefully get this eaten before we have to leave. Though she's taken a little bit to make her breakfast, so we should have gone with something quicker. Or I think she has some leftover salad as well. Oh, hey, and our mail's been delivered. We'll probably not have time to grab the mail before we have to go, but <laughs> I want her to get her food eaten real quick. All right, can we grab the mail real quick? Oh, nope. <laughs> not quick enough. Alrighty, so let's go ahead and maybe knock on the front door. Oh, there's a different front door, apparently. Why did we spawn on that side, then? That's weird. <laughs> okay, then. So, I have never been to this house, actually. So, let's see what all we have going on. Um, It's not a bad place, actually. I don't know where we're at. I want to say Windenburg. Where are we actually? Like, I, I genuinely cannot tell. Okay, we have some kind of runes thing over here. So this is definitely either... Well, I was going to say it's either Windenburg or Cottage Living, but I've seen Cottage Living several times, and I don't think this is Cottage Living. I don't know. It's hard to tell. Anyway, um, let's just look around and see uh, what rooms uh, we could possibly do, because we're doing a room renovation again. So, but this is actually really cute. This room is a little bit empty, so we can maybe do that. Let's go ahead and talk to our clients. So we can get to know them a little bit and see what they're wanting. Let's go ahead and ask to see her mood board, see what all she's interested in. She likes garden decor. Alrighty. Um, let's show our portfolio. To be like, hey, so this is what we've done in the past. We did a yellow kind of office space in Mount Komorebi. <laughs> oh, and gate condos in town. Nice. Alright, and we should definitely try to introduce ourselves to the other people as well and see what all they like. Dislikes DJ mixing. Alright. Likes the color gray. Alrighty, so why don't we go ahead, woohoo, um, and we will come upstairs, I think I'm gonna do this room, and we'll turn it into a little, like, maybe gardening space, um, if I could, I'd like to get rid of these windows and try to make it a little bit more 
open so that way we can have like maybe a little like greenhouse kind of space or whatever. Alrighty, so let's take some before photos. All right, so let's see what we got. We'll take a picture over here. Whoa. I'll do a photo of this area. And then because I want to try to put new windows on here, I don't know if it'll let me or not, I'm gonna get a picture of that as well. Right, and then we'll go ahead and send the clients away so we can do our thing. take some after photos. Let's see, what all did we have before? We had, I think this angle. A little snap picture of that. I know we had this angle with the windows. And we also had a picture over here. And let's go ahead and call the clients to lot. And then we can go ahead and get some of these going. It's by the door and then we have this and this. All right, we are going to host the reveal event and they are here. So let's go ahead and follow them up the stairs. Maybe, where are they going? Um, hello? A real renovations to client, maybe. We're getting a phone call from Penny right now. Um, you should follow your heart. It's really not the time to be asking us this right now, but you know what? It's fine. All right, so now let's head up the stairs, <laughs> and uh, we'll see the room renovation. And here we are. So nice, so much brighter. Oh, I completely got those angles messed up, but it's fine. You know what? It looks good though, doesn't it? Oh, she really has to use the bathroom. I swear, some of her needs always gets like completely ruined anytime that she's doing anything. So why don't we, oh, hello? Game broken, career broken. Hello? Hey, <laughs> can I get you to like, I don't know, maybe do what you're supposed to? I don't know what's happening. I broke the game, check this out, check this out, check this out, it's like, they're going all over the house, just not even. What do you mean you can't? Whatever. All right, let's chat with the clients. We didn't even introduce ourselves to Rowan. So, oh, someone referred to us. Let's ask about taste in music. Then we'll ask about career. Dislikes S-pop music. 
All right. And then we just have to wait for the final verdict. All right. Looks like she's still showing off some objects to peeps, but... All right, here comes Eleanor, though. Maybe to actually look at the stuff that I was trying to show off to her. All right, we are checking on clients, making sure that they like what they see. I think this came out pretty cute. We have a heart, which means she likes it. Yep. All right, he is ready. So let's ask for the final verdict from him. All right, what does he think? He likes it. All right, and what are they doing? They're in a flirty mood. I don't think I like this because last time this happened, people started woohooing while we were on the job. All right, so first of all, let's thank for the opportunity because why not? And then we'll ask for a final verdict from her and then one from him as well. All right, looks like she liked it as well. And now we have to get a final verdict from him. And he likes it too. Awesome. All right, we got 648 simoleons from that. And our reputation went up. I think we're doing pretty good at this. And I'm actually really happy with this. A lot more than I was with our last gig. All right. So I'm guessing we didn't get the mail before we left, right? No, we did not. Uh, so Let's go ahead and get our mail. Um, we also have a lot of photos, so why don't we go ahead and delete those. Or sell those, I guess. We don't really need them. Alrighty. And then, why don't we chat up with Penny a little bit more? Ooh, tell dirty joke. We're feeling a bit flirty, are we? Mm -mm. Oh. I was going to say, was that our dirty joke and she didn't like it? But should we attempt to be more than friends with Penny Pizzazz? Possibly. It's a possibility. I'm not opposed to it. You know, I, I just want to test the waters a little bit. I just want to see if we can get something going, potentially. Did she like it? Yes, she did. Let's compliment her appearance. Because why not? Then I'm going to... Ooh, what's this? Got a package. Hi, Harmony. I'm Sally, a representative from Kindermaid Enterprises. We think your aesthetic is the perfect pairing for the Kindermaid brand. We'd love to consider using some of our playful furnishings in your future decoration jobs. Please accept this gift as a thank you for considering us in your future collaboration. One Drago can be found in the household inventory. Is that one of the... Um stuffed animal things i wonder i bet it is <laughs> all right i'm really no um no i guess it would help if i did that huh anyway um maybe oh they made that a lot more difficult like i remember we used to have to click on the toilet for them to actually use them. I wonder when they changed that. Yeah. That wasn't something you needed to know, but you know what? <laughs> it's fine. Alright, so she's gonna go stare at a painting. Is there anything happening down here now? Ooh, looks like there is. We have another busker person down here. I mean, it looks fairly normal. Um, is GeekCon still happening, I wonder? I can't see it now if it is. Oh, yeah, it looks like GeekCon already ended, so we missed it. Well, you know what? Why don't we, to celebrate kind of the end of a good work day, let's take Harmony and Penny out maybe to karaoke. Why not? <laughs> Harmony is not a good singer, but we can always make her a good singer. So we're going to go to Planet Honey Pop and we're going to do some karaoke together because I think it'd be fun. Alrighty. It's happy hour at the karaoke bar. Everyone dr enjoys drinks at a discounted price. Don't mind if we do. Let's order drinks for the group. Let's get some 
Let's get some buffalo wing tea, because why not? I know we just got here, but it looks pretty empty so far. Who we got? We got Dina Caliente. We have, I'm going to guess this is Bess. Am I right? Yep, Bess Sterling. Uh, we got Jagger Fong. What an interesting name. Bye, Dina. All right, Tuesday night, no one is down for karaoke, apparently. Looks like she's having a good time, though. She's talking to, what's his name? <laughs> Faze Jaleel. Hmm. Oh, okay, we got some more people coming in now. Why don't we go ahead and try to sing it up a little bit? Lucia took our spot, but you know what? I figured she couldn't do it because of Lucia, but let's go ahead and let her use the bathroom real quick, because she really has to go. Oh. And El Faba just walked in on us. Fantastic. All right, why don't we go ahead and go here? Actually, you know what? Let's go here together. Oh, let's sing in karaoke contest. We'll do Weekender. Hopefully. We got a crowd on stage. Yeah, this is not going to be good because she has never sung before. But it's fine. You go, Harmony. Where's Penny at? Penny's over here talking to Akira. Oh, is Penny coming over to watch her performance? He's like, okay, it's not bad. Good God. <laughs> We caught the attention of Agatha Crumplebottom. Oh, and Judith Ward. We scored 54 out of 100. All right. Well, why don't we go ahead and sing a duet with Penny? Because why not? And we just got people getting all up in Judith's business. Ah, uh, look at these two. I love them. <laughs> oh, they're so cute. <laughs> Alright, we have Thomas Watson coming in now. It's picking up a little bit. Ooh, here comes Bella Goss. See, we're getting some people. It's not entirely quiet. <laughs> and Lilith Vader, uh, or Vittori, Vator, I don't know how the name is pronounced. Our, a vampire is the bartender for tonight. Oh, and someone passed out in the bathroom. So I wonder when the end of the contest is going to be. Oh, is Penny leaving? Where did Penny go? I don't know. Looks like we're a little bit hungry, though, so we're getting some food. I guess Penny left us, but... What? The results are in, and Harmony Cardigan won the contest with an impressive score of 54. Wow. I can't believe we won that. That's amazing. But you know what? I think we had a pretty good day, then. We won the contest, albeit very unexpectedly. But you know what? I think it's been a very successful day, and I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here. So thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, subscribe to the channel and make sure you have notifications on so you don't miss anything. Be sure to follow my socials. Links are below. I'll see you all soon. Bye.